Where did asteroids come from? The first asteroid was discovered by Giuseppe Piazzi, an Italian priest and astronomer in 1801, while making a star map and named it Ceres. It has also been classified as a dwarf planet and accounts for a quarter of all the mass of all the known asteroids in the main belt. If all the asteroids were combined into a ball, they would be smaller than the Earth's moon. The word asteroid means star-shaped or star-like. That's because during its first discovery, asteroids resemble distant stars when viewed through a telescope. Asteroids are leftover bits and pieces from the formation of our solar system 4.6 billion years ago that didn't form into a planet. Some are too small and didn't have enough mass and many collided and shattered into even smaller pieces because of Jupiter's gravity. More than 150 asteroids have a moon or even moons and in 2013, an asteroid named Chiriclo was discovered to have a set of rings. Most are found in the asteroid belt and have an irregular shape because they are too small and don't have enough gravitational pull to become a sphere. There are three main classes of asteroids. C-type or carbonaceous asteroids are the most common and are grayish in color consisting of clay and stony silicate rocks. They can be found on the asteroid belt's outer regions. S-type or silicaceous asteroids are greenish or reddish in color made up of silicate materials and nickel iron and are found in the inner belt. M-type or metallic asteroids are made up of nickel iron and are reddish in color. They can be found in the middle region of the belt. In 2001, NASA's near Shoemaker spacecraft was the first to land on an asteroid. Japan's Hayabusa was the first to land and take off from an asteroid in 2005 and return samples to Earth in 2010. In 2016, the Osiris Rex was launched to explore the asteroid Bennu. An asteroid has an average orbital speed of 25 kilometers per second. The largest known asteroid is Ceres and has a diameter of 945 kilometers. The smallest is 2015 TC25 and is only 6 foot wide. It was observed when it passed by the Earth in October 2015. 100 tons of material from asteroids and comets fall towards the Earth every day, a piece of an asteroid fall every year, and an asteroid the size of a football field hit once every 2,000 years. On February 15, 2013, an asteroid 65 feet wide crashed into the city of Chelyabinsk in Russia, injuring 1,200 people. As of June 19, 2017, 16,209 near-Earth asteroids have been discovered with nearly 1,800 classified as potentially hazardous asteroids. On April 13, 2029, 99942 Apophis, an asteroid about 320 meters wide, will pass by the Earth closer than our satellites at 30,000 kilometers above ground. It is the size of a football field and would cause global disaster if it ever hit the Earth. To save our planet from an unfortunate event, the Planetary Coordination Office is currently developing technologies that would either move an asteroid's orbit by slamming a spacecraft into an asteroid, or gradually altering its path with its own gravity by using a spacecraft.